Hello and welcome back to another vlog. You probably saw me either in my most recent one or the next one. I am wearing the same outfit and I am in the same position. It's, I don't know what the time is. It's half three on a Friday um, and in Dubai, I'm not sure if you know this, but in Dubai the weekends are Friday and Saturday, not Saturday and Sunday. So yeah, it's Friday today, half three. We have spent the whole day working out finances, cleaning the apartment, getting it all ready, blah, 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 blah. It seems like this is all that we have been doing since, literally since we knew we were moving apartment. Packing, unpacking, sorting, and I just am so sick and tired of doing anything apartment related. So hopefully, nothing in this vlog is apartment related, although you probably want to see apartment stuff, but I don't. So, I want to, firstly we're going to go for lunch, then, um, I don't know what we'll do after that. Then it's date night, so we're going to go for dates, dates, <laughs> we're going to go for dinner. Um, I will bring you with me. And then tomorrow, weather dependent, because as you can probably see, the weather is very cloudy and not sunny at all. So, I won't be up to sunbathe, um, I don't think but hopefully I can. <laughs> no idea what we have planned for now, as long, um, I know we are definitely going for lunch though, but anyway, my arms are killing me. <sighs> so, see ya, bye. Okay, so we are now just heading to Dubai Marina Mall, um, which is one of the smaller malls here. Um, we just wanna go grab some food, um, and I wanna go and find a little notepad, journal kind of thing. Um, so yeah, bring you along with me. It's really tiny. Um, we're not gonna go proper shopping, are we? Maybe. <laughs> are we? No, we're not gonna go proper shopping. <laughs> um, lights are green. Oh. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we will see you in the mall. 2020 is our year. 2020! 20, 20. Does anyone else do that? Like, do really weird stuff like that in the car with their boyfriends? So, yeah, I am doing it. <laughs> see what you just said? So, yeah. So, yeah. Basically, just go into the mall. So, yeah. And I'll see you in a <laughs> Okay, when I said it was small, I meant small compared to Jazz. But it is actually still quite big thinking the moment now. So pretty. How to keep the human if it's cold you know. Sometimes everything just gets hard. Sometimes everything just gets harder. Feeling like I'm missing some parts. Never think I'm getting more stuck at. Even when I'm doing it. You're so fussy. <laughs> what? You fussy. What? You can't walk past mango and not go in, especially if they have a sale. So, here I am. I said I wasn't going to do any shopping, but I can't make any promises, so. That's cool. Oh my god, that is literally like a duvet. I love that. Oh, why is it not cold enough? I mean, I shouldn't really complain. This is the shop that I was saying about. So this shop is literally the best place for like little like convenient things. So I really want a phone ring. I think I might get this one. I think it's quite pretty. So gonna get that. Oh my god. Does that look ridiculous? I just ripped it open, but I think it looks cute. I like it. I think it looks really expensive. To be honest, it's mainly just for convenience because I always drop my phone out my hand so hopefully that will keep it stuck. We've just got back from the mall, really full up. Just had um, the Carlucho's pasta. It's really good. Um, I tried to find like a journal or notepad or just something like that 
and they didn't have any. They only had ones with like pictures of acrylic nails on, which were like not what I was looking for. So I didn't get that. Um, but I did get the phone ring that I'm literally obsessed with. It's not even like amazingly nice, but it's really handy. So got that. Anyway, Alfie's literally just rolling his eyes at me because he probably thinks I'm just chatting rubbish. But we are going to a place tonight called Karma Cafe. I've heard so much about it, but I've never actually been. And it's like, um, it's by the Burj Khalifa, so it's overlooking the fountains. And it's an evening brunch, so it's unlimited food and drink um, for four hours. And you pay, I don't know how much it was again, like... 80 pounds or something um and we have this app called the entertainer which is amazing if you live in dubai actually they have it in london now too it's called the entertainer and you pay annually for it and you get everything barring it on free it's literally a dream so anyway i just did a little promo for them but um so yeah we're going there and i need to get ready but i can't stop eating i'm i'm so full up though I don't know how I'm going to eat unlimited food and drink for the next four hours. Um, and I'm going to be so bloated after that pasta. But, hey. Um, I'm wearing a really nice dress tonight, which one of my besties gave me. Um, so, I need to try that on, because I've never actually tried it on. But it looks nice on the hanger. Um, need to do makeup. I think I'm going to curl my hair. And then... Yeah, get ready and go. Ta-da, I'm ready. Um, I skipped out the whole getting ready part because it would probably take too long. Um, and I'll do like a proper video another time. Um, but I will really quickly just show you my outfit because we are late. Um, so this like slinky midi dress from Misguided and the heels are from Steve Madden. Um, and then my watch from Cluse and the love bracelet um so yeah this is the outfit um i need to actually grab a bag so i'm probably just gonna get a little black one um and then we're going so, yeah. to find my place chasing me on lights and looking for some kind of trace to lead me out of darkness give me a little faith something to make me stronger someone who could like the way then you came to me and you gave me reason Can't believe it. Every time we touch, I feel at home. There's no way I'd ever let you go. Oh, sorry. <laughs> um, so we've got sushi, and I don't know what that is. Um, and this is my vegetarian one because I don't eat meat or fish. And um, this is like asparagus carpaccio. So. Yeah, that's good. Oh my god, I'm literally not going to be able to move. But there's like grilled aubergine, miso, um, gozas, whatever they're called, and calamari. This was really good though. And now I'm trying this without the fish. <laughs> I would just pop and fly around the room. <laughs> huh? um, yeah, so I'm gonna take my makeup off, put my pajamas on, and get some sleep. I can't wait to get into bed. So we had a really nice date night, didn't we? Lovely date night. Lovely date night. It was so nice. Um, but the weather, oh my gosh, it was literally pouring down with rain um and it's freezing and obviously there's no heaters there's no like radiators in your apartment it's only aircon so like you can't really get hot you just have to like wear 
pajamas and get in the duvet so that is what i'm gonna do so i will see you tomorrow i don't know what i'm doing tomorrow um i guess if the weather's rubbish then just chill um but yeah gonna get some sleep so i will see you in the morning good night good morning it is now saturday um i spent the whole morning in bed watching youtubers which is like my favorite thing to do on a saturday morning um i had some breakfast and then i just really quickly got ready um i need to go to mall of emirates and take back some things um i'll show you so i have a few things to take back so I got these AirPods for Christmas, but when I plug them, like connect them to my MacBook, they just, it sounds like I'm underwater. When I put them on my phone, they're fine. Um, so I wanna go check there. Um, this Healthy Glow foundation from Charlotte Tilbury, I have heard that it is literally like a miracle, but I have really olive um, undertones on my skin. And so when I put this on, it's like really red and blotchy. Um, and I spoke to one of the guys there and he basically said that I could like exchange it um, It has been quite a long time now though, so hopefully I can still do that. If not, I'll sell it um, And then I got this jumper from Shadowvarius, which I really loved um, However, it has a rip in the sleeves here in the silk bit So I've still got the tags on and things. It was about £25. So yeah, I need to go and see if they can exchange it or credit note or whatever. So yeah, I'll just show you my outfit too, if it's in focus. Um, all black Primark leggings, which I'm literally obsessed with. Leather boots from Topshop. Um, a little bag. This is the Zara like polo neck jumpers um, and this like faux fur black gilet which I don't know where it's from. It hasn't got a label in. It has been raining all night so I don't know if you can see on the balcony but look how like filthy it is. Um, basically it rains so much all the sand and everything so apparently the roads are really bad so we have to try and see if we can get to the mall because there's no drainage system here so everything floods <laughs> going into the apple store now to try and see if they can fix my airpods so i will report back in a second i'm sure they'll be very helpful it turns out it's probably my macbook pro that is the issue because i tested it on their one in there and it worked perfect so um, either I need to do a new update or I don't know really um, but I'm really annoyed because the main reason I wanted them is so that I could like edit um, and do like my editing on Premiere Pro and stuff with the AirPods um, so yeah I'm sure I'll be able to fix it if not I will call Apple support and they can talk me through the methods and I should be able to get it sorted but other than that the airpods are amazing by the way and everyone needs a pair because they're literally a dream you take out one airpod and it stops the music so that you can hear someone when they're speaking to you amazing i just think it's genius but anyway um uh, we are going now for some lunch um i brought a few bits in the home center shop um which is probably nothing too interesting like some candles and um like a makeup organizer um so yeah, I won't do a haul on that one. Um, I'll save you the pain. This restaurant is literally one of our favorite restaurants in Dubai. It has the nicest food. Um, so we just went for the breakfast one. So this is um, patil shakshuka, which is basically like poached eggs in like a spicy tomato sauce with feta cheese crumbled. Um, and then you have it with like the baguette. And yeah, it was so good. I don't think it's wise to measure with your feet, to be honest with you. This one is nice. That is just very impractical. It's gorgeous, but that is not gonna fit on our balcony. That might. That That's is... what I mean. There's like five feet, right? Our balcony is five feet. 
more than five feet. That's five feet. No, because that's on one, one, two, three, four, five. Your feet are smaller, obviously. You didn't measure yours, did you? I measured with mine. I would like this. Um, if you remove this stuff, then it's just like plain. Obviously, remove all this. And then these two little chairs pull out. And then what you can also do is tuck that all that and then that well I've done it the wrong way around these come off that goes down and then it basically slides underneath and it just tucks away so it's all nice and neat so that's the one I want and he wants this big fat thing but I mean it's nice but there's no way that is fitting on our balcony like once you actually have people around for dinner and stuff and you all sit out this side and this side there's no way in hell that we're fitting that on our balcony. This one, on the other hand, would fit, but the other one, no way. And now he's looking at an L-shaped sofa. I don't know how big he thinks a balcony is. But darling, it is definitely not gonna fit, is it? <laughs> it does not. Anyway, I said at the start of this vlog, I didn't wanna do anything furniture related, apartment related, but here we are in the car on the way to Pan Emirates, which is a furniture shop and it's the biggest Pan Emirates. So I oh, wish me luck. I'm really tired now. I just get so bored of shopping after a while. So I want to just go home, get into comfy clothes, put on Netflix and chill. That's what I want to do. Right. So I realised I've been filming this whole time and I have a hole in my jumper which is very embarrassing. Do I? Oh wow. Well I must look like a right idiot walking on the top today. Um so sorry about that. Sorry that I literally look like I can't piece together a bloody outfit. <laughs> what are you know? <laughs> but anyway, yeah. Just apologies for the hole in the sleeve. Right, so we are stuck in the worst traffic. We've been stuck here now for about an hour. Um, so I thought I'd do a little, show you what I got. So I was looking for a journal yesterday, couldn't find one. So I picked this one up from Shadavarius. Um, it was, what is it not focusing? 10, mm, about 12 pounds. So it's a week by week agenda. So I'm gonna open it up and I'll show you what it looks like. It'll be pink, blush pink um, leather one. And it has, um, it's a week by week one. It's got an overview of 2020 and 2021. Um, I love this because then I can see what date my birthday falls on, whether it's like a weekend. <laughs> so I always like to look at these little bits. Um, and then the font's really cute. You have um, the four month overview here um, and then you have your week by week ones. So yeah, for 12 pounds, about 60 dirhams, I thought it's a really nice little journal and I'm really happy with it. Oh my God as well, look at this. I just flicked to the end. Oh, how cute is that? Look at the flood. We are in the middle of the road. Well, what was the road? Look at this. It's so deep as well. Oh my god, that's so bad. Oh, we're literally driving through it. Jesus. <gasps> Look how deep it is. It's literally up to the guy's like thighs. Oh my god. Oh my car's moving alright. Just part like drive up this way a bit more. Oh my good gracious me. That car is actually like flooded. Oh my gosh. It's not always like this, I promise. <laughs> I thought that I would just end the video with a skincare routine because a lot of people had DM'd me and asked for one. So I'm sorry that I look I think I'll take my makeup off um, and then in the morning my makeup's already fine. I use normally like a sensitive skin wipe so this is the Nivea sensitive one with 0% alcohol oh, by the way um 
we are like a week later <laughs> because I've had work and I've been busy. You can take your makeup off with this, but I like to just go over with the makeup like fun. I just put about this much. These are so good, they're from Primark. You get like 100 for 90 bit. So they're really, really good. Now. Pixie Glow Tonic. And I just run it around my face. And then I will use the Nip and Fab Absicillic, I think that's how you call it, Sicilic Acid, which is concentrate 2%. Um, I don't really know what this does to be honest, but I put a few drops on my cheeks and my jaw. And then once I have finished with the salicylic acid, I will then go and use the Pixie Rose Ceramide Cream. This one, and I just put a few blobs. That smells so nice. This is actually a really, really hydrating cream. I was really impressed with it. And then the last product that I use is the Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Cream. This is really, really good. It's really hydrating. You can use it on your face or on burns or your hands or whatever. I just put a tiny Tiny bit. Like this. Put it on my lips, and then any excess, I'll just rub it in my hands. So take the makeup off. I use a face wash. I use the glow tonic from Pixie, the salicylic acid, if that's how you pronounce it, the face cream, and Elizabeth Arden eight hour cream, which I put normally on my lips or hands. Um, so yeah, really, really good products. This is going to be my routine for a really long time, but I do love to change and try new products. Um, but these are all working perfectly. So that is the end of my skincare routine. A few people had messaged me and asked to show my routine, so I thought I would just add it at the end of this vlog for you. Um, but yeah, if you have any other recommendations, let me know because I love to try new products. Uh, but anyway, I'm gonna leave the vlog here now because I am so tired and I need to get some sleep because I have work tomorrow. But um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the vlog. Please like and subscribe. And I will see you next time.